What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Forza Horizon 4 and the autumn season of series 40. Today we're going to be knocking out the weekly Forza-thon challenge being over the road. So we need to own and drive a raced tune heavyweight tractor unit. The 2015 Mercedes-Benz number 24 tank pool 24 racing truck. That is a mouthful. But let's go ahead and get jumped in to that. As you can see, I'm driving the Veyron Super Sport right now, which we unlocked in... Well, we didn't really unlock it in the last video. I showed you how to unlock it in the last video through Super 7 High Stakes. So if you haven't seen that, definitely go check it out. Um, I ended up failing on that. And, you know, to me, it just wasn't worth going back to do it. And I ended up just buying the truck... Or the, the Veyron, not the truck, from the auction house. So... I bought it for about two million, but I'm not too worried about money in this game. It always seems to be around when I need it. I haven't bought very many, if any, cars, or not, I haven't bought very many, only like a handful of cars in the game. The other ones I've just unlocked from, you know, playing, doing these seasonal challenges and stuff like that. So there we go. We got heavy duty completed. So that was the first step. The second step is going to be win three street race events with our mercedes-benz race truck so we need street race events well, let me make sure, make sure that it says street race it says street race not road racing but street racing so you need to make sure we make that abundantly clear and only look for street scene and we'll just jump in and knock out three of these real quick um, it shouldn't be too difficult. Here we go, looking at the bumper and only the bumper for Badlam Gate Street Race. And let's go ahead and get it started. Hopefully we can actually compete with these racers. This truck has not been like great to race and drive in the past. Let's go ahead and jump in here to the interior view. Um, right now it's only in B class because uh, I think it's I mean, I would get absolutely murdered by, you know, racing S1 or S2 class cars, so I just kept it in B class to hope that I can be a little competitive. Ooh, it don't turn, though. I don't even know what I hit there that made me, like, oh. hit the wrong button there. Now, I'm not even sure if it was the, well, there's a car off the road there, but I don't know that that's what I, oh, there was a racer. That's what I hit. Oh, turn. I don't, I'm not a big fan of this truck, um, I'm not a big fan of the trucks in this game in general, is what I should say, but, um, you know, we've got challenges that it calls for to use them, so we're gonna try to do it, um, you know, to kind of expand our driving repertoire, if you will, let's see, come on, I don't know how this Raptor is up in first place against all these Subarus. Doesn't make much sense. But then again, they just got taken over by a uh, semi-truck, so I guess that's all that matters, but we're up in the first now. I'm gonna go ahead and just skip through to the end of this race. I don't know if I'm gonna like actually like record the other races, because, I mean, they're easy enough. They're just races, nonetheless. Um, I guess I can talk about one thing while we, you know, finish up this race is I'm going to be doing a giveaway for Forza Horizon 5. Um, I'm actually going to be doing two giveaways for Horizon 5. One of them will be uh, day of launch, so November 9th, and the other one will be whenever the channel reaches a thousand subscribers. So um, for the day of launch one, that's what we're looking at right now. I'm um, going to have three requirements for that. The first one is you're going to have to be subscribed to the channel. So if you aren't subscribed, definitely go ahead and take this time to go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Um, you're also going to need to be in the channel's Discord server. Um, a link to that will be in the description below. Um, you don't have to stay in the Discord server after the giveaway. You know, even if you win, I'm not going to hold, you know, be like, oh, I own you now or whatnot, you know? Like, I just need an easy way to communicate with the winner, and the Discord server is the easiest way for me to do that. Um, and the final requirement will be to comment on a video that I'll post in the future. It'll actually be the very first video of Horizon 5 that will be posted to the channel, and I'll have more details about that later. 
um, about what to comment and such like that. But um, definitely keep an eye out for that. I got the premium edition pre-ordered, so I get the game a few days early. So on November 5th is when I get the game and when that first video will come out. So definitely keep an eye out on that. But that's one street race done. I'm going to go ahead and do two more real quick. And um, we'll jump on into the third chapter of that challenge after I get done with those. Alright, so we're coming up on that third victory. I ended up just doing the same event three times. Um, but when you do that, you have to make sure that you, you don't just hit restart here. You have to actually go all the way out and then go back to the actual event on the map and start it from there. So... Um, I did try to do another one. I just it had too many turns, I guess, because I ended up coming in second. But nonetheless, you can do the same one three times. We did get the power puller or pulling power completed. And now we need to get three stars at any speed trap in our truck. So let's throw on a better tune because we're definitely not going to do it with this one. And then we're just going to have to find a speed zone that allows for a... Um, pretty straight, uh, or speed trap, um, that allows for a straight shot. So, I'm gonna throw this tune on the, well, it's, I'll show the, there's a share code for the tune that I'm using. It's from you, Grundy. So, 126-266-703. Um, it bumps us from 1,000 horsepower up to 2,400 horsepower, which is just absolutely insane, so... And it costs a pretty penny to make that kind of an upgrade, obviously. Alright, so looking at speed traps, I don't know what our top speed of this thing is. So 195 there, 210, 150, that's the... That one probably won't work out in our favor. Um, hmm. 225. Trying to find one that's like relatively straight. Uh, let's let's go try this one. I'm not necessarily sure how fast this thing even is with the 2400 horsepower. So this will be an experiment, I guess. All right, let's just dart right through. Okay, it is pretty quick. I don't know that we're going to get the speed we need, though. So 150 is what we hit. And that was 180 is what we need there. Okay. Well, that gives us a better understanding. Trying to find which one we can do. I'm not really 100% confident. And any of these, really. So that one's 150. It's also coming out of a turn, but we'll go give it a shot. All right, starting about a mile out. Let's see what we can do. Trying to get a better view of this. Yeah, that turn is just not gonna work for us. Dang. Um, that one might be our best option. 140, and it's actually after some straights, so. <sighs> I'm not a big fan of this truck, and I'm not a big fan of Weekly Forest Thon Challenge that directly deals with this truck when there are way other better, cooler vehicles in this game that it could deal with. Thought I was making it. 
Again, the truck's just too big. Okay, we didn't make it there either. So I need to go back under Horizon Online. That way we don't have to worry about Drivatars. Blocking the road with their big old trucks. We'll say it turns a ton better now with this tune on it. So 140 is what we need. I think, we can, yeah, we should be fine on that. There we go. 159. And we're straight crashing into everything else. <laughs> the guy, we see him spinning. All right, so the engineered to move is complete. So if we go in here and look, we just need 10 trading paint skills. So, um, jump over into the city. Um, up here into, where's our castle? I think this is one of the easier ways to get it. It's not necessarily hard, it's just time consuming. So trading paint is you just gotta basically run into cars on the side. Oh, missed him. Oh, missed him too. Got two there. Got one there after we had just absolutely demolished that many. It's hard to not just absolutely demolish them in this. Was a trading paint. We literally like booted him off the road. All right, can you get out of the way? All right, how many more do we need? We need one more. Okay, we're we're at the light at the end of the tunnel. We are almost there. Just one more trading paint, and we'll be golden. Yeah, that was smooth. There we go, trading paint. Basically just demolition derby in Edinburgh. Whew. All right, well, that is the weekly Forzathon challenge, the over the road. Forzathon challenge. I hope you guys did enjoy or found the video helpful. If you did, definitely leave a like on the video. Definitely get subscribed for future Forza Horizon 4 content and get subscribed if you want to, you know, be eligible for that Forza Horizon 5 giveaway that we're doing when the game launches. Hope you guys do have a great rest of your day and we'll see you in the next one.